Hi beauties! So this is going to be a hair tutorial on this curly Halloween inspired hair which I really hope that you like and this video is in collaboration with MakeStyle which is a Norwegian website so all the products that I'll be using in this video are from there and I'll of course link to all of them down in the description bar. So yeah I really hope that you find this tutorial helpful and let's get started. I'm starting off by dividing my hair right above my ears and the top part I'm just swirling around and then I clip them up with some alligator clips by must and as you can see these hold up so much hair so I absolutely love these then I bring the bottom part of the hair to the front before curling your hair you always want to go in with a heat protectant spray and this is the GB heat styling spray and I'm just spraying that all over and this spray gives hold and some shine so it's a three-in-one product then I'm combing through my hair using the Richie Grande hairbrush. Today I'll be using this Must Volume 1 curler and I've set it to 210 degrees Celsius. I like starting at the back part of my hair and then I take a piece of hair and spin it around the wand and I bring it towards the face and then I keep it there for 15 to 20 seconds and I kept this in real time so you guys can see how long it actually takes. And I personally like very firm and tiny curls, so that's why I keep it in there for so long. But if you want more wavy and loose curls, then just keep it in for 7 to 10 seconds. And also take bigger chunks of hair if you want that. But my hair is so long that I like those firm curls and they will loosen up during the day anyway. So here you can see how tiny these curls are, but they will eventually get bigger. For the next strand of hair, I'm bringing the hair from the face instead of towards it, which I did with the first one. And this will help separate each curl so they're not that stuck together, and I just really like that type of look. Now with the next one I'm spinning the hair towards the face again and I'm just going to continue doing this throughout the whole hair. So here's the first part done and then I did the other part off camera and it looks like this. And you can see how big the curls have become just after a few minutes. To keep these curls out of the way while I curl the rest of the hair, I just clip them together in the back. Next, I take out the two hair clips that I have at the top of my hair and then I divide the hair and bring it to the front. I'm of course also spraying this with the heat protectant spray. And then I comb it through. I'm doing the exact same thing here as I did with the bottom part of my hair and with this back strand I'm just bringing the hair from the face. With the next one I'm bringing the hair towards the face and remember to curl the very end of the hair as well so that part isn't straight. Now this front piece of hair I always curl towards the back no matter what because I don't want it to fall onto my face all the time and just ruin my makeup. Here I'm just quickly showing you the other side as well. Then I'm just bringing all the curled hair onto the front. I'm going in with the same hairbrush and this brush has both natural and synthetic bristles. So it combs through the hair and the curls very carefully. I'm going in with this GB Styling Spray Soft and I'm spraying it to the top part of my hair to give it some volume. And then I spray it to the rest of my hair. So here you can see how the hair looks like from the back. Now to make this into a more Halloween type of hairstyle, I'm taking these two purple roses and I'll be attaching them to the hair with hair ties. I take a piece of hair and I place the hair tie very close to the top of the head. 
Then I'm pushing the rose into the hair tie and I'm doing the same thing right next to that with the next rose. I only want one rose on the other side and as you can see the rose has a tire attached to it so that's how I just push it into the hair tie. Then I go around the roses with a piece of hair just to hide the hair tie and it will also make the hair look bigger. And here you can see the end result, just lots of curls, cute roses, and I just really like this type of hairstyle. And it can go with a lot of different Halloween looks. Okay guys, so I really hope that you like this final result. I absolutely love it. I really love these type of curls. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely day and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.